Hello everyone, this is the column I'm learning soldering from Andinstar. Today, with the help of Microscope at 409 Pro, we will demonstrate how to solder QFP44 component. Before soldering, align the direction of the components with the small circular points. Now, fix the components onto the solder pad, there are two ways you could choose. You can apply a little tin to one corner of the solder pad first, and then move the components over to heat the tin on the solder pad and fix the components. Or, just place the component in its corresponding position, press it down with tweezers or fingers, and then solder one of the edges of the chip with your soldering iron. Next, let's move on to today's highlight. Solder the pins in sequence except for the fixed end, and then solder the edges used for fixation. Start with conventional soldering method. For chips with dense pins, I usually use a blade soldering iron tip for drag soldering. The second methods, you can also apply a large amount of tin to all the pins first, and then uniformly remove the tin. Due to the dense distribution of pins, it is easy to have solder joints during soldering. Let me explain how to solve this problem. Place the inclined surface of the soldering iron head tightly against the solder on the pin, heat it for 1 or 2 seconds to allow excess solder to adsorb onto the soldering iron head, and pay attention to the angle and force when picking tin. The angle should ensure that the inclined surface of the soldering iron head fits the pin, and the force should not be too large to avoid damaging the pin. Knock the tin adsorbed by the soldering iron into the cardboard box and remove excess tin from the pins in small quantities multiple times. If it's really hard to separate, just add a little flux. If you don't really like either of the above, try the third one.
Add a circle of flux to the pins before soldering, and you'll find that soldering will become easier. If you encounter any problems during the soldering process, please leave a message below. If you like this video, you can like it and follow us for support. See you next time.